Hello guys, in this video tutorial I will show you how to import the STL file to FreeCAD and create the 2D draft from STL file. So, uh, for this um, uh, purpose we will do this uh, next uh, workflow. So, the first step we will import the STL file to FreeCAD and convert it to 3D model a solid body of 3D model. Uh, this um, a mesh format with triangle um, and this will be the solid body uh, it analytical uh, model of um, you can to save it for example in step format and the th third step will be creation a 2D draft from this. Um, we have to create the 3D model with uh, analytical because we have to delete the triangles from SCL file and uh, it, it will be very um, uh, good uh, approach for creation of 2D draft in the next third step because we cannot to make this from STL to 2D okay so let's go to FreeCAD and let's I prepare the 3D model in STL format and I will import this file in STL format so let's see how looks this 3D model and uh, let's choose it in tree and let's visualize the flat lines these triangles of STL mesh okay uh, we have to delete these triangles from for 3D model uh, okay let's choose this STL model and go to part workbench in part workbench uh, we have in menu operation create shape from mesh let's choose it choose the default tolerance for merge of shape click OK and uh, let's hide the STL model in tree we can do it using the space button on keyboard and uh, here we have the shape of 3D model with faces and which uh, includes the triangles faces triangle and the next step let's create the sol solid body for this STL shape okay let's go to the part in, mo in menu and convert to solid command let's perform it click space button for this and let's uh, click this refresh button for generation the solid body so it looks similar like a shape and like a still file but now we can to delete uh, this uh, edges of triangles let's choose it and go to command refine shape let's choose it and how can you see um, we have the clear geometry without triangles but uh, we have the some trouble with circle because uh, we have the triangles uh, for our circle we have to um, convert this to circle real circle so let's choose this STL and choose this face and let's go to part design workbench and let's choose this solid body and click the create body in part design workbench okay uh, the body was created with best future of solid of this model okay so let's choose the face of this uh, 3d model and let's create the sketch on this face so now um, 
we have to improve the shape here delete these edges it uh, will be the analytical circle hole uh, of here so let's click on this command we can to export of this segments of line here and make it for this and uh, let's create the circle by th three points but in this mode uh, we have to create the support mode of these um, lines because we have to make the some uh, next operation using the two and other circles uh, you understand it in the next step so let's go to mode sketch and make operation the toggle construction geometry it will change the mode of this um, menu bar and if we will choose this toggle let's choose it and click uh, on the three points we can see uh, we created the toggle and let's to know uh, which value of the radius we have here it 25 millimeters this diameter of the shape so the next uh, let's go to sketch a geometry and click uh, toggle construction geometry again we will change the mode of toolbar to normal and uh, let's create the some smaller hole here okay uh, for this two for these uh, lines we can to create the part of 3d model and to merge this all uh, segment uh, segments so let's go to, let's choose the sketch and make the part operation but we have to make the part for this uh, surface for, for for this purpose let's uh, make the reversed mode and uh, we have to know which lens uh, we have for the hole let's choose some edge edge here and for this edge uh, or for for now if we will choose this it we can see that we have in Z direction zero and if we can choose this surface you can see that we have the 20 millimeters in that direction it means that we have this edges line uh, 20 millimeters uh, this line length of this line okay so uh, let's set the length of extrusion of this cylinder set 20 and we have the true length of this pad so uh, let's make the refine true and it will delete these edges so uh, the next uh, let's choose uh, this surface and create again the sketch so let's um, import the this circle to sketch from external geometry edge and uh, we can to choose this circle for creation for example the center and create the circle for example it will be 20 
and set the radius let's set 25 millimeters okay close and now for this circle for this circle we have to make a pocket operation we have to remove this volume from the model let's set it some very big value and so now we have the clear geometry without some edges from here so let's show how look the initial STL mesh file it looks with triangles but now we have the true geometry without the edges and we can to save it uh, for example in step fi format file here but uh, we have the third uh, last step let's go to tech draw workbench and let's create the 2d draft of this so let's insert the page and uh, here we have to choose the template of landscape uh, i will choose some for example a3 landscape of this and now um, let's choose this model and we have to import the view in the different direction to this uh, draft so let's choose the body let's choose the view it will be top view and let's create insert view button here and we will get this and also if this uh, dimensions really big we can to make the scale for example if you increase but we can to de decrease it sorry it will be 0 0.5 okay that's how it looks here yeah. or maybe 0 no 75 and i think it looks good and let's go to the body again and let's choose the another view it will be the front view click the insert view but also we have to scale it 0 0.75 go to the body and let's paste this view it will be the right view here insert it also we have to make the scale 5 okay so now it looks correctly so let's uh, choose the different edges here and set the dimensions for example it will be the radius the length of the model let's choose these two points uh, I have used uh, the control button on keyboard and click on these two points and uh, let's set the horizontal dimensions here it 250 and let's choose these two points vertical dimension let's choose for example these two points also this vertical dimension ah no this will be horizontal dimension okay and then sec and let's set these two points And these two points also okay so now uh, let's set these dimensions here for example and these dimensions also okay so now it looks uh, good we have set the different dimensions we can to change for example the names ok 
a and the another parameters from table we can to change the position of different views he from here and also we can to hide the points and this view supported lines okay and after that the, the team the draft looks uh, good and you can save it in a different formats you can to export page as svg file and export as dxf okay so um it's a finish of uh, this tutorial thank you for watching so try to the channel goodbye